Hi, my name is Brian Thurow. I'm an associate professor in the Department of Aerospace Engineering at Auburn University. And I'm here to talk to you a little bit about a project that we recently got funded uh, through the Office of Naval Research. The Navy is very interested in jet noise because they have a number of uh, sailors uh, on, on their ships that are exposed to jet noise on a daily uh, basis. And this has actually led to noise-induced hearing loss, so they are dealing with this issue on a daily basis with a large number of sailors losing their hearing um, due to their exposure to simple jet noise. And, and everyone's seen the movie Top Gun and you see these jets taking off. Um, and, and when, when they take off, they're at full throttle and it, it creates an incredible amount of noise, incredi incredible amount of pressure fluctuations. So the Navy has a very strong interest in understanding this problem. Uh, the issue, though, is that anything they do to try to reduce that jet noise typically uh, reduces the performance of the jet as well. And that's not an acceptable uh, solution to the problem. So um, what we proposed, and this is a collaborative effort with the University of Mississippi as the lead, uh, the University of Texas Austin as a partner, a, a company called Craft Tech and Auburn University, is to study this problem in a very unique jet facility that they have housed at the University of Mississippi. Uh, where Auburn's unique role in this work comes in is high-speed flow diagnostics. And if you think about a hot, uh, if you think about the exhaust from one of these jets, it's very hot. It's uh, traveling very fast um, on the order of four to 500 meters per second, which in football terms means that something in that flow is moving about five football field lengths every second. And so to see the dynamics of what's going on at that scale, we need diagnostics that are able to look at the flow and take images at hundreds of thousands of frames per second. And so my laboratory has specialized in the development of these diagnostics. We've built a laser system that can uh, illuminate a flow with laser pulses at up to a million frames per second. We have a unique high-speed camera that can also take images at that same rate. And so the real goal of this project is to use the unique facilities housed at Mississippi with our unique diagnostics as well as some analysis techniques being developed at Texas to really take a big chunk out of this problem and better understand the flow physics that is leading to jet noise and if we understand it then we can start to develop ways to mitigate that noise, reduce that noise without any uh, performance issues associated with the jet.